All right, people. Welcome back. More daily duel. So we have slate here. E. So using them for all decks. This hand's pretty good, actually. It's not terrible. So let's see how this duel plays what a out. Surprise. I've had like an hour of sleep. Oh, the hate. Oh God. Not it's the hate. And die back. Huh? Oh it's... no! I thought. Wait. Did he reveal a die back here? Let me go to the log. Oh no, he didn't. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. This this guy's good. Oh my god. This guy I thought has... he, no, I thought he I thought he revealed a, a Mayo Sengi back which the Pendulum Monster is not that good. It's expensive though, so set the back row, set the back row, set the back row, set the back row, set the back row. This deck is full of hate. Like that's all this deck I guess is, the, is hatred. <laughs> the problem with the problem with Mayu Senju back is that they don't play Yosenju Shinshu R. They just play Yosenju Shinshu L. Cause L is better than R. I know, I know, but therefore they can't pendulum summon. They don't want to pendulum summon. I know, oh, dude. Why are you? Yes, I understand that. So what's the problem? <laughs> because dieback is good, but they don't play R. So they don't play dieback. That's what I'm trying to say. All right. Um, this hand is really bad. All right. Um, I mean, there's not much you're going to be able to do because he's just going to fuck you up. But it should be interesting. Um, though. Yeah, you know, poke if you can. Okay, I'm gonna get since there's so much back row, I'm gonna get my floater out there. And then I'm gonna summon Bora and then just poke poke. And set black sonic. All that right. sounds pretty good, right? Do I also have a, I also have a clue. No, you're just gonna get compulsed. Alright, but that was stupid. Like this is a tuner. When I I play, you know six Boras, you know what I mean? So whatever. Oh wait, I guess never mind, that wasn't stupid because now he just made it so I can't summon Bora. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I, I literally I can't do anything else. That, that was no surprise. <laughs> All I'm saying is that I, you'd think he'd wait to compulse until I made my synchro if he saw a tuner on board. But I mean, I guess that was a smart move because I wasn't going to synchro. He just so hated hand even the idea of you getting a plus off of the synchro summon during the end phase. He just says straight up, like, no, I'll take the neg, but you're not playing your black wings. Like, okay. Now the question is, is his partner here, is he going to play a monster? Because as soon as he plays a monster, then his uh, counter trap won't be able to be used. So, yeah, that is the question here. And if they're both playing the same deck, then... Uh, wait, wait, wait. What does the counter trap do? It's it's like a barrier, except they have to have only... They have to have a Yusenju card on the field, and they can they have to control only Yusenju monsters, so... Pretty much. Okay, so now this guy has the. Now, now we don't have to worry about it since this guy has Kushino. Exactly. Okay, cool. So, pretty much we don't have to worry about his counter trap anymore. Now, the rest of his back row, I mean. Let's find out. But as long as that fabled monster is on the field, we don't at least not have to worry about that. Yeah, this this deck is just straight up hatred. Like uh, from the way I've seen this deck, it literally just loves to just play a ton of back row, a ton of hate cards, and be a stun, stun, stun deck. Like wow. There's clearly something back there that's gonna fuck me up. So. Oh man. Do you play Quick Chaos? I don't know what that card does, but you should, if you play it, I don't know what that is. Never even heard of it's it. It's a rank of magic. It's a, it's a quick, it's a quick play rank of magic, but I forget what the restrictions on it are. Like I know it's not uh... as limited variance force, but I don't know what it does. So much. But you should look though. into it if it's good. I'm not sure if it's good though. I don't understand how that's funny. <laughs> Lol. You hit me with back row. It's some game mechanic in Yu-Gi-Oh! that's so hilarious. God, I do not like this deck at all. But as soon as I flip up this decree, he'll pretty much be out of this duel. Unless he has MST, my bro. If he had it, he would have MST during the end phase. Doesn't you send you camel? Does, does comma one restore or sorry, return the face of card or monster? Monster. Okay. 
What did I draw? Why does it shuffle my hand when I draw? Uh, I guess new? I think yeah, it's, it's new. It's an update, I guess. It did, up, it did an update for me today. Oh wow. Okay, so I have double flute. Okay, so I can pretty much go in. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go in. All right, normal summon. I'm just gonna like, huh? Special. Although I guess Exiton's not negated right now, is it? No, it's not. All right. Um. Not that there's any reason to Exiton at this current moment, but... Yeah, because yeah, I have the victory speed, but I was just thinking. And you're... Uh, I, I can attack with it. I can attack yeah, with it. Yeah, you can attack with it. Yes. Alright, um, yeah, I know. I just had to gather myself, alright. Um, Pot, reveal one monster, and then the rest of it's just back row, like, alright. The deck is so inconsistent that it has to run back row to keep up with it, to help with the consistency. Plus, it's a pretty fe flexible deck, so it can run a lot of the Hatred cards without being really phased. Such as... That's a level 3 tuner. This is um, like spell for a grants and... Mistake, and Macro... So and... I need to... Uh, I'm trying to see if I can... If I can win. I don't think win? I can. No. <laughs> yeah, because I've, I've, I've double fucking Kalut, man. 16,000! I know, I know, I know. I'm, but I can do lots of combos with no thong. And plus, I have snatch steel. Mm, um, nah, take it slow. Don't, don't. I'm just looking. I'm just looking. I'm just looking. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not gonna do anything stupid. Um, because we have decree and we're in control right now. Mm -hmm. And I have black sonic, so I'm just gonna attack. Yep. But I mean, if I could win, obviously, like if I can do the math in my head to figure out that I'm gonna win, there's no reason. To if you could do so. sixteen thousand damage in one turn, I'm shit. I don't not in black wings. I don't think in black wings. Maybe, uh, maybe if you uh, well, have like your Nothung, dark matter. No thung allows for a lot of combos, and then Hawk Joe. If I synchro with no thung, Hawk Joe can revive it, so it's pretty good. <clears throat> I think it got its name changed to Obsidian Hawk Joe, which sounds fucking awesome. I thought you didn't like Hawk Joe. Uh, I play one, um, just because it's good late game. But uh, my deck used to be like really turbo, and I didn't play any traps or anything. But now, um, I run you know some traps, so I just thought Hawk Joe would be better for late game. Um, all right, so now I need a synchro. Should I set Black Sonic in case they get MST? Yes. Partner, can you get rid of Decree? That's a good question. Yes. Okay, look, I'm not forgetting to activate Panaka. Let's go. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, you don't want to forget about that. Oh, shit. Did I lag out? Did you? It's saying waiting. Fuck, I'm going to lag out, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yep. yep, we lost connection. It my my computer just came up and said DevPro is having a problem and it's gonna shut down, so I can't do anything about that. What's the problem? It just said DevPro has to fix the problem and it said we're gonna close the program and I hit the click close program and it'll cancel or anything like that. So I don't know. So what do you wanna do? You wanna just get another one in and attempt it again? Yeah. Alright. Are you talking about what they <laughs> slap at the end of your name? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So you have $6,000? Like, damn. Where'd you get that money? <laughs> I know, right? That's enough for, like, one Necroz deck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can buy one Bionic. <laughs> Freaking oh, Dim Frickin Demetrius. Um, I'm pretty good. Demetrius right. has the entire Necroz deck in German. Okay. This hand would be really good. If okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to set double emptiness and Icarus attack. I'm going to wait for him to summon a monster. And then if he goes to special summon, I'm going to emptiness. And because I have a Shura, so I'm going to attack over the Shura. And I'll have a Panaka to use with the Icarus attack. Okay. I'm fine. I think, <laughs> I think that's where I play. If I had a Kalut, I'd just summon the Shura. But I have a Kalut and a Bora. Or a uh, Shura and a Bora. So. Yeah, we have double emptiness. I don't think we need to be fearing. And I, I own four emptiness right now because, you know, 
that clutch box opening got me poor emptiness. I can play Evil Swarm now in real life if I want to. I have the whole deck. That's good. Um, yeah, I guess until I play Necroz, I could play Evil Swarm. Even though I don't like, I don't think Evil Swarm is good this format because of Unicorn. Unicorn is just too good. But Unicorn can't and, get over Ophion. Um, but I guess it negates its effect, and then you can go ahead and yeah, uh, go into ritual others. summon some others. Yeah. So um, that's the problem because I mean, you know, obviously Brynak is a simple way to get rid of Ophion. Like it just spins it back. So. Shit, they didn't summon anything? Aw. No. I guess the other guy can still go, but... I want my, uh... I want my, uh... My plan to work. He, they want... They need to summon a monster? I mean, you could have summoned Bora. Oh. Well, why are you going after my cards? The three I cards... Guess, like, oh, wow. That's fine. We have another emptiness. Mm-hmm. He, he's blind and received for no reason, because, you know, we have another emptiness. You hit my card, and those three cards are sitting there the entire fucking turn, but the card I said is the fucking one that you gotta go after. Like, alright. What the fuck? <sighs> Shit! I guess we still have the emptiness, but now mm -hmm. my plan is down on the drain. Mm-hmm. I was gonna get the plus off that Icarus attack, but okay. They're spacing like hella, like, damn. And before, he doesn't summon a monster. <laughs> Just set something, please. I want to get yeah, my yeah. Space back. Over. But sure. Oh, Blackwing Mirror. <laughs> wow. All right. That's cool. Don't. Uh, don't. I don't know. Are you? Are no. you thinking about flipping the emptiness? Nope. Okay. No. no. Okay. Because he could just. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. Wow. I guess you want to get the float off that guy, though. Yeah. So you're, we're fine. We're fine. Let him synchro and everything. Like I said, I kind of wish that you would have just summoned the Bora. I don't know why you didn't summon the Bora. I don't know why you went in. Yeah, I don't even know why you went to Hawk Joe. I was kind of dumb. I was on the Armor Master. Uh -huh. or, or any other level 7, like fucking Yazi would have been great. Yeah. Yazi is my bro. You know who else is my bro? Clear Wing Synchro Dragon. I need to put that in here because I didn't. I, this is you know, not up like I don't know. I just didn't put it updated for uh, Cross Souls, so I need to put Clear Wing Synchro Dragon in my deck. Card's good. It's an effect negator, which is important. Oh shit! I drew another stack anyway. Um. Okay, so nothing in the graveyard that I need to activate. Uh, yeah, I don't have any plays. I guess oh, I'll just I, set it. That's awesome. Huh? Don't you, you have the Icarus attack? Can't you summon the board? Yeah, I know. That's just, I'll set Icarus and set, or does board, yeah, it doesn't need to be face up, so yeah. That's fine. I'll send MST again. <laughs> really, Icarus attack? Alright, that's a surprise. Wait, you um, know what this guy is playing? MSTs. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> uh, pick a back row any back row. Uh, I picked one for you. Okay. I pick, that's the newest back row. <laughs> Starlight Road. <laughs> what? I mean, you might as well activate vanities. Never mind, because Icarus is gonna go. Oh, wait, how would the how would the chain go? Activate vanities. Vanities would vanities stop this. Vanities, vanities would be face up when Icarus went to the graveyard, so vanities would go. But uh, Stardust Starlight Road would be like it would stop stuff something. But this is the other guy's card, unless he has a Stardust too. I think he just activated this to block. All right, so no. And if he does have a Stardust, then you know what? Fuck me. <laughs> I haven't seen the. Well, I mean, I haven't seen I have that no idea record. what his deck is, but. It plays Starlight Road and MST. Starlight Road? I haven't seen that card in fucking forever. I don't think it's that bad, because, you know, Regeki and Dark Hole are pretty prominent. I used to think Gungnir was terrible, but honestly, Gungnir is only good because Rageki is legal. Like, 
I don't even think Gungnir would be played if Raigeki and Dark Hole were not at one or not a one and two. Like, Gungnir is not good at all, but we need it to for, to protect our Jinlock from uh from Raigeki. Yeah. That's why it's sitting at like sixty dollars or something like that. That whole deck is just pretty expensive. Yeah, I know. Oh, so it's Mermels. Yeah, definitely empty against that. You got another one? Mermel, whoa. Mermels are, uh, it's not going to trigger, yeah, it's not going to trigger this. Mermels are good because, um, of the new Abyss, whatever her name is. You saw it? Mm-hmm. Neptabyss, that's her name. I don't like it that they put the Abyss at the end, like, what the fuck? <laughs> um, but her name is Neptabyss, and she can combo with Deep CD for really well, and, I don't know, you, you probably saw it on the RGG Hero, right? It was mm -hmm. a while ago. You promote a lot yeah. of it, okay, it's the one where he was walking through the forest. <laughs> yeah, that was hilarious. So it's the only place he can record now. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> the forest. <laughs> you called it the forest. Icarus Tech. Yeah, Icarus Tech, that's gotta be a set. Or Black Sonic, actually. Oh yeah, that might be it too. All right, we we won. Oh, nice. right. is that it? No, we're at sixteen minutes. We can get one more in. All right. All right, we are back. I mean, yeah, when the new support gets even announced, Black Wings will go up in price. I mean, if well, you want to pick it up now. What I already stuff there's uh, there's super collude. Well, I know every like pretty much everything in the original print is common, but I kind of want to get the reprints because I like my cards to look like new. <laughs> but um, I'm. Kalut came out of Astral Pack 5 as a super. Um, Gale came out of Premium Gold as an ultra. Not Premium Gold, uh, Legendary Collection 5Ds. Alright, I'm gonna go. Normal. Special. Set. Set. It's like, how come he didn't synchro or something? <laughs> yeah, right? That's really going to be wondering. Nah, but, but Panaka's so good. Like, Panaka's so good with, with uh, Icarus. Fusion Sage. Okay. okay. This is probably Fluffles. 50, <laughs> 50 cards. Fluffles have been going up in popularity. Well, the, um, the you know, new support for Fluffles is, is like, good. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not tier 1 good, but it's tier 2 good. So, um, Fluffles are a deck. They have a Miracle Fusion. Yeah. Um, which is which makes any deck amazing, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> Zero Gardena. <laughs> um, no, I'm not gonna change anything. Jeez. I guess during the end phase, I should probably Icarus or the or the the main phase two or whatever. Yeah. End of main phase. See another card. Yes. Yeah, I don't want to have to deal with that or that back row. Although I love Zero Garden as a card. Like when I played Final Countdown when it was a three on DN, I loved Zero Garden. It was like one of my favorite uh, stall cards. It's a stall card. It is a whole bunch of them. He set the poly. Oh. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean what? <laughs> I made mean, a boo-boo. Not really. You're playing a shitty deck, so. I mean, I, I didn't see your mistake. I mean, I can't, I can't see your hand. Yeah, that that set that should have activated set was, it. That set wasn't a mistake. It was a. Um, oh yeah, I a, mean, yeah, you should activate it, Zero Gardener. All right, now I see where your mistake was. It is full speed too. So you could have changed. But it. isn't it until the end of that turn, or is it your opponent's next turn? During this turn, so it wouldn't matter. Yeah, so it wouldn't matter. Yeah. That's why I killed it. Like, if it was, if it could have worked until my next turn, I wouldn't have killed it. Like, there would be no reason to kill it now. I'd kill it on my next turn. Um. Are you going to do something, sir, in your turn? So some more back row? Well, uh, well, I mean, it's not like, it's not like he meant to activate the poly because it said end of main phase. So, you know, obviously he ended his main phase. Mm-hmm. You know, to the, the end phase. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't see where he messed up at. Like I said, I can't see his hand, so I can't 
backseat duel for him. <laughs> Just waiting now. You want to do anything else, or is this your way of admitting defeat by just waiting for the time to go by? Yo, if I ever go to Vegas, like, like you know, just because, I don't know, like, gambling or whatever, can I, like, hang out with you? Of course. Okay, that's cool. We have to get... If I ever go to Vegas, I'm going to get you up. All right, that'll be cool. <laughs> we have to get in contact with Simo, too. Yeah, that'll be cool. Yeah, Simo's bro. All right, end phase, yes. I haven't seen Simo in forever. I think that the last time I saw him was he's that. hosting like... that. You saw that contest he's hosting, man? Yeah, he invited me. Are you in it? Yeah, he said he'll try to squeeze me in. Because, you know, right. now since okay. all the big YouTubers want to be in it, there's a pretty good chance that I won't. I'll get bumped out. I think, um. Well, I don't know. You're pretty, you're pretty big. I mean, there aren't that many channels that have. What, what, how many subscribers are you? Like 1,300? Yeah, but, you know. Freaking oh, Vexy and all of them are gonna be. Well, yeah, but yeah, but there's, there's yeah. not that many like big, big YouTubers. Like probably like ten. You know, so he'll probably prioritize wait, getting whoa. them. Oh shit! Is Simply Unlucky gonna be in it? If Simply Unlucky is in it, I'll watch the whole thing. That I want to see him. Oh, we want. I want to see him duel. Though. Uh, no, I know they're trying to get Mega Capital G, but it's just hard to get in contact with that man. Uh, Asian Ice <laughs> says that he probably doesn't want to join. That he doesn't want to do it. Are you in the? Are you in that Facebook group? The YouTube Illuminati. Mm -mm. Oh, okay, I, don't, I, was... I don't. I don't do Facebook. All right, because that that's where the tournament was born out of the YouTube Illuminati. Um, I used to be in it. I used to be in it. Oh, like, that Cali tournament effect... came from. Oh, what? Yeah, what did yeah. Cali that, that, do? that group, dude. You have to see who's in that group. It's just like all the big names. Even even Mega Capital D's in it because he has a Facebook. He just doesn't use it. Mm -hmm. So um, you know, Asian Eyes is active in that group. Galactic God is active in that group. I was in it. You for, said like, something about Cali Effect. What about him? Two weeks. I'll, I'll tell you in a sec. I was in it for like two weeks. And um, basically, uh, not necessarily in that group, but just in general, like on Facebook, uh, Ryan Nisker and Cali Effect got annoyed with how I was acting. So they told, because the group is owned by Underworld. So Underworld, they told, Under, and, and Vexicus, and Inch95. So they told uh, Underworld to kick me out. So I was in that group for like two weeks. Why did, even they, why channel, did they tell you to kick you out? My channel only has, because I was just being, like, I was, I think the... Oh, because you weren't doing anything really, on your channel? Really, I don't, I don't really want to be talking like shit right now, but, but the whole point is like I wasn't, I was, I'm not allowed in that group anymore because I messed with, uh, I messed with Ryan and Callie. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I don't want to. I was kind of worried. I thought you were, you got kicked out of the group because you're associated with me. No, <laughs> no, no. That that is not why. Why does Ryan dislike you too? Because I know Callie and you don't get along. I don't really know Ryan. All right, Ryan. I don't know. Ryan used to be cool with me, and something happened, but whatever. <sighs> I don't really want to talk about no, it. No, I'm not part of the Facebook group, so no. Simo uh, asked, asked me on Facebook. Okay, cool. cool. Yeah, he, was like, he was like, you won during this tournament. Simo seems nice. Simo seems like... Simo, Simo's chill. He, Simo, he is? Okay. He's Simo is chill. All right. He, 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 I don't know. He just he seems like like he, he's just happy all the time. Like, I don't know. I want to hang out with him. <laughs> yeah, he, yeah, he's, yeah, he's very he's very energetic. I, like I said, I've only met him twice. Have I you met, ever dueled him? No, I've never dueled him. Oh, okay. Uh, All right. I made I met him at my college because he was there one day, and I watched him duel with Teller Knights, and then I saw him at the Las Vegas Regional, but I wasn't I didn't enter because I was already late. So, who else did I see? I saw, you know, uh, you know, P Bunny. Yeah, of course. All I was right. just talking to P Bunny yesterday. Actually. Yeah, yeah. I met I met P Bunny, and I dueled um, what's his friend's name? David or something? Uh, I know who you mean. The guy who does the after school Yu Gi Oh! Yeah, I, I, I dueled him in the YCS Anaheim. Yeah, you told me. About, yeah, I remember that. You told me about that, yeah. Yeah, he, no, kicked the, the he, he fucking fire leak looped the shit out of me. I'm like, damn. <laughs> anybody, and if you see anybody that you even relatively know at a YCS, like, that's gotta be hot. Like, that, that's crazy. Yeah. That would be so fun. And, and, and freaking P Bunny, I was like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he's like your favorite. <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, he is. Remember, because during the next year, YouTuber, P Bunny was like the guy that you wanted to vote for every every round. That since I met him at that one, that pissed me off. He was like, hey, he's like, oh, hey, yeah, you're the Cali effect, right? Oh jeez. I'm like, oh, and you're Asian eyes, right? Oh shit. <laughs> Fucking that's racist, terrible. man. I look nothing like Marcus. Oh, uh, his name is Marcus. I thought his name was Leon. It's his name is his real name is Marcus. 
Okay. He because he his name on Facebook is Leon Kelly. That's his middle name. Oops. Okay, so cool. Spoiler for everybody. <laughs> yeah. What, what, what's Kelly? Is that just? Is That's that his nickname. Okay. Whatever. We gotta stop talking about people. Like I feel weird. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and end this video. Have... So thank you, Slate, for joining me. Oh yeah, this was this was fun. Yep. So are you planning on doing anything with your channel? Yeah, you, well, yeah. I do something with Deskbots because that that kicked the shit out of me, so I want to see um, what you yeah, can do with I've it. Yeah, I've actually gotten multiple requests. Whenever I get on DN, I'll get a message from somebody who subscribes to my channel and be like, you know, play Deskbots. Uh, I used to talk to this guy. His, his his name on DN was like the normal guy or something like that, like normal something. And every he was he was messaging me about playing uh, Des Deskbots and Necroz. And the funny thing is, the OCG plays Deskbots and Necroz now. So, like, it's cool that he predicted that. Um, anyway, yeah. So I'll, I'll I'll do some with text bots if you really want me to. All right, I just want you to upload. <laughs> yeah, well I'll upload. I uploaded last week. I'm about to get on this YouTube grind. <laughs> My friend Slacker Magician, uh, who I talk to like on the daily on Facebook, he got um a, he he got a guest upload to Asian Eyes's channel, and Asian Eyes and he got he he doubled in subscribers. He has 1,600 subscribers now. That's crazy. He had 800. Now he has 1,600. That's awesome. So, I know it is awesome. That's awesome uh, so that you got like Asian Eyes to guess upload because Asian Eyes isn't really the one that he'll let you do it. Well, he usually the, says the thing no. Is, he, he, he didn't ask though. Asian Eyes found him and wanted to up, guess up, upload him. Like, isn't that crazy? It's a dank series, is what he does on his channel. Um, definitely go check out Slacker Magician's channel, by the way. I guess I'll give him a little promo. I'm also going to give Slacker Magician a promo in my next video. Okay, but, I, I can uh, slap yeah. his but, link in the description. Okay, cool, I mean, he's cool. bigger it's... than me now, though. <laughs> yeah, well, he's, well, I mean, yeah, it's just because of that one guest upload, though, you know? So, hey, I'm waiting for my good. Mega Capital G upload. So, you know, whenever, uh, you know, whenever you guys can, check out Slacker Magician. He's my bro. Yeah. Right. He makes good, it's Tank Series, so you know, he makes that kind of video. Yep. All right. Cool, cool. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And if I haven't seen you in a Mega Chaos video, I'll see you guys tomorrow with Stu and Sandy. Alright, guys, thanks for watching.